Hello friends, welcome. In this video I'm going to display the skills on the table here. We are in the skills index. Now for the table I'm going to use one of the here. I'm going to copy the flow byte and let's open and use here the table from this website flowbyte.com. So I think we have Tables, yeah. Okay, let's copy this and let's go inside the resources, skills index. It is the div. After the div, I'm going to add the table if i save and let's go inside the skills we have something like this okay now we need all the skills to display that and for that i have created behind the scenes some skills so if i refresh yeah okay now to display the skills i'm going to go inside the skill controller and here on the index, we can just say the last line skills to be skill all. But uh, I'm going to create a resource because we are, we are going to use Vue.js. I'm going to create the resource and manipulate the data there because I want to display also the image here. So let's uh, open the terminal and let's close for a little bit the npm and say artisan make a resource and i'm going to name it skill resource and then run npm run again so npm run dev okay let's go now inside the resources to the skill resource and what i want to display here for the skill we need only the, the ID, which is going to be dollar sign this ID, the name, the same, just say this name. Now the logic is for the image. I want the full URL of the image. So for that, I'm going to say here asset and say storage slash dot the this image so here we have the inside the storage slash storage slash for example skills slash the image okay now if i save and let's close this one instead of skill all i'm going to cut this and say skill resource collection and paste the skill all here and let's add that one here so I'm going to say compact skills now we added skills as a prop we need to define in the index Okay, so after the import, I'm going to say define props and we need, we have skills which are an object. Okay, now we have the skills. If I come here and let's refresh first and let's uh, inspect the elements, go to the view. And here we have skills and inside the skills we have the data and here we have an array with all of the skills and as you can see now the image is the full url what we need okay let's go and make a v4 in the table what we need for the table to display we need to display the id so let's 
So here is going to be the ID, the name, and the image. So ID, name, and the image. This one is going to be empty because here I'm going to add the edit and delete button. So let's close this and remove all of them, leave only one. Okay, yeah. Now in this one, we need to make a V4. So V4 uh, skill in skills dot data because we have data here as we saw earlier so we have data skills data and then we have uh, the skills okay and we need to add the key to be skill dot id uh, key like this Okay, and here I want to display the skill ID, the skill name, and the image. So let's add the image with a source. We need to bind the source because the source is coming from skill dot image like this and here is going to be the edit and delete buttons now let's save and let's go and see what we have so here yeah we have something like this we don't have the image because we need to run the php artisan storage link so let's go inside the terminal and run artisan storage column link to create a sum, sum link and npm run dev close this Come here and refresh. Again, we don't have why we don't have the images. Source image source skill image. Yeah, we have the storage. Oh, yeah, we I make a mistake in the, I think, in the resource. Yeah, in the resource, let's just say storage like this. And let's refresh. Yeah, here we have all the images. Just let's add the in the image, I'm going to add some classes. So let's say width 12 and h 12 and around that full. Around that full, like this. Save. And yeah, that's it, the table. Okay. That's it about this video. In the next video, we are going to display the projects. So see you there.